Hello and hi everybody. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Welcome back dreamers. Thank you so much for coming in. I am your host, Anna. Thank you so much for stopping by. I know you didn't have to, girl. So thanks. Um, as you could tell, I've been trying to work on my smoky eye game. Um, I, I still have a long way to go trying to get this down. But I wanted to show you because lots of people ask me um, what color eye palette are you wearing? What are you, you know, rocking? So I'm just going to tell you real quick. This is, um, this was in one of my Ulta hauls. I am a, a shine bride, like a diamond at Ulta. So I do spend some money there. Um, this is the Wet n Wild Holiday Foxtrot palette. And I did get like two different palettes from this individual line. And so, so cute has a polar bear and a little fox. Again, this is from Alta Wet n Wild, but you should be able to pick this up also probably from, you know, CVS or Walgreens, your local drugstore. Uh, this is the colors that I played around with today. This one right here, and this palette's called Sugar Plum Whiskers. And this is how I did my smoky eye with this beautiful emerald green. I know it looks like it doesn't look emerald green, that's the color I used to get the smoky look today. And then I put some of this on top. So it's one, two, three. Okay. Just so you guys know, put this with my macchiate. No, I got to put it back there. And I'm still working on my craft room, as you can tell. It's all good. And as far as my lippy, because a lot of people ask, um, this was from my She Glam lip liner from my Shein haul, my beauty Shein haul. And I don't, this is 523. This comes in a three pack and you know, the three colors are very similar. If you, you do it like this. So you see how dark it comes out. Okay. So that's this color. Okay. So what I did to lighten it up is I used my beauty intuition lip gloss that I shared I think on my second to the last haul or my last haul, I can't remember. Um, this is from Dollar Tree and this just, you know, works magic. It just softens it up. There you go. See, it softens it up. So it's not so bright, but you're still using that color and now you get this really pretty color. Yeah, so I used it with this. Again, you can get this the full size. I shared how they had the two smaller ones in Beauty Intuition for this lip gloss, and then they had the full size. I thought it was like a weird color, but then I was like, wow, this is going to be a really nice one to use for those darker tones that I just need to lighten up. It's beautiful. It's working out great. Okay. From the Dollar Tree. All right, so let's go ahead and get into this. Um, the first thing I'm going to share with you is just a few a few foodie items slash stocking stuffers for my boys. Uh, so I found the Twix a cookie dough box. Um, they had that available. This is kind of like those box candies that you can get at a movie theater, you know? And also this one, this is a cookie dough Snickers. So I got each one of them one for their stockings. There you go. And what are they? 3.1 ounce each. So plenty. Nice big box. That's a for the boys. And then I got these for their stockings as well. Um, they have these out every year at the Dollar Tree. This is the Rudolph Red Nose Reindeer um, Snack Mix. And it comes in two different packages. It's the same exact snack. So you can either get the one with the Santa or you can get the one with the reindeer. Or it's about the same. I picked out the wrong one. There's one that has a different picture on it. Sorry. Well, the snacks are really good. They have um, peanut butter filled shapes, pretzels, and peanuts. And they're really yummy. So if you see these, I highly recommend them. They're very good. They, they're very tasty. So that's for their stocking stuffers. Then I found this, the Drizzle Licious uh, Cookies and Cream. This is a, is a cookie dough dusting and Nestle White Chocolate Drizzle. Uh, made with Nestle Toll House. So they have this popcorn available right now. Drizzlelicious. Again, cookies and cream flavor. And they use Toll House. Some of the Toll House seasoning, I guess. Um, it's a pretty big bag. I got it for the house. Uh, it's a two ounce. Not too sure how it's going to taste. But I know I still have my, my Snickers 
powder that I got from Dollar Tree. So if it doesn't taste that good, I can melt a little butter and then, you know, put a little butter, melted butter, and then put some of that powder on top just to, you know, change it up. So I have that. And then I did get the Chocolate Bar Bar Landmark, the dark chocolate and cappuccino. You guys, this is very good. <laughs> this is good. And they're like individual bars, um, individually wrapped gold bars in the inside for each serving. It's like a, a little stick. One, it's like that. And they're individually wrapped just like that. They're really good. I highly recommend it. This is the one that I like, the dark chocolate and the cappuccino. That's that's. That's, that's the one I like, I think. Or was it the caramel? Dun, dun, dun. Will we ever really know? I'm going to figure it out, though, girl. Okay, and then from... And then we're going to hit the... We're going to hit all these. We're going to hit all of these in a second. Then I got... I, everybody's been hauling these to sugar-free. Previously called breezers. Halls, uh, soothing throat, cool berry. You get twenty drops. Um, they're they've been sharing another another one that's available. My store only had this one, so I did pick it up. And it has a fantastic Best Buy date of twenty twenty five of uh, May. So a very nice long shelf life. Very nice long one. So that was nice. And I did get some comment for the bathroom. Okay. And I got lots more to share with you, including this really cool hydroponic system little thing that they had available at the Dollar Tree. Come back tomorrow. I'm going to release that video tomorrow. I was like, what? They have this here? Crazy. All right. Now we're getting into the beauty aisle. Again, you can get this from the Dollar Tree Beauty Intuition. This really unique, weird color lip gloss that does magic on darker shades. Then I did pick up the foundation brush by MB. Is it MB or MHB? Must have beauty. They had different variations of it. Let me pop this open. Here we go. Let's see how this feels. Ooh, this is soft. Beautifully Beautifully um, colored here. The coloration is real pretty. Super soft. Wow. And I love the handle. Can you see the handle? Yeah, honey. If it don't shine, it ain't mine. So it's got this really cool glitter look to it. So I had to get it. I had to. I had to. No, it was pink and it was gold glitter. <laughs> then the same company, they had the eye tools with that same really cool pink and gold. Let me check to see how these feel. That brush is very soft. Okay, so that's what that looks like. See how pretty that is? I don't know, maybe I should have done it like that for this one. See how pretty that is? That handles just everything. Um, very soft. And of course, this one's stiff. You know, that one's stiff versus this one's nice and soft. Uh, seem to be just fine to me. I'm glad I picked them up and they're super cute. And then for nail polish, um, they had the new brand called Candy Moya or not Moya, but um, look, I'm going to start talking Spanish, but otro nombre, no English, Anna Candy Moyo. <laughs> and this is in the color 924. So this is a beautiful gold color. 924 so i'm looking forward to trying that one okay and i'll probably try it on top of this color i just did my nails i took off my blue and i need to put a topper on it because i'm not feeling this like cranberry-ish flat color i need something with a little sparkle then i picked up this one from candy moyo it's 930 do they even have names no 930 but it's a beautiful deep dark like burgundy cranberry burgundy color really pretty beautiful for of course what yeah right now winter and autumn when you pull out all those cranberries the browns the chocolates the wine colors this is when you do it so i had to pick it up 
Then uh, I got the LA Color Ice Pigment Powders. I only picked up three. I got these three. I got Glisten, which is this first one, Twinkle, the middle, and Foil, and that's that one, okay? So it's the color that you see on the outside of the box is what's in the inside. Yeah, so the color that's on the lid is what's in the inside. So it looks really pretty. It seems promising. So I'm looking forward to trying these out. Now, let's get into these. Woo, this was so exciting. I never get to find like nice big palettes. Everybody else and their mother finds them except for me. <laughs> these were in um, the store next to Aldi's. Okay, I'm sure they're going to bring them out in the store next to Rainbow, hopefully sometime soon. So keep a lookout, okay? All right, so let's start off with this bigger one. It's called Desert Rose, and it is by Beautiful, F-O-L. And it says something here at the bottom, Be Beautiful Cosmetics. So this is a Desert Rose Baked Eyeshadow Bronzer Palette. So this one was available, beautiful packaging. This would be really nice for, um, you know, a gift for somebody who enjoys cosmetics and likes to play with makeup, trying to change up their look. And you know, when you change your hair color, none of your old makeup works. And if you do something extreme, it's like nothing really jives. So it's nice to see that Dollar Tree has these really nice optional palettes, you know, available right now, especially if you're making big changes with your hair and your look and your clothes and changing your accessories. And I could tell you right now, this is beautiful. The outside of it feels very high end. Let's take a peek. I haven't peeked at them. I haven't even looked. I'm, I'm right with you. There's no mirror, but this is what they look like. Wow. wow these are gorgeous okay so they have names what are some of their names this one's dandelion golden golden mallows desert rose mojave aster salva salva what salvadorine mariposa lily San Verbena. They got some really interesting names. There you go. Let me see if I can get it. Let me take that off. Look how gorgeous that is. Woo, girl. Mama's going to have a good time playing with this. Yes. I love these colors. $1.25. Girl. Insane. Okay. Okay. Let's keep it going. I'm going to be playing with this. I'm not going to be sticking, dipping and sticking my fingers in here right now because I really want to like wash my hands before I do that because things that go near my eye, I don't like to play around with unless they're like, you know, thoroughly clean. Okay. The next one is part of their winter. They're calling it winter and it comes in this really nice packaging. And in the back, it gives you like a little preview of what the colors would be. And um, it says Four Seasons Eye Face Palette. This one does have a mirror. And let me see if I can take this off. All right. And let me do it like that. And there's the palette. So you have all these really pretty colors. You see that? really pretty colors um maybe i could do it like this okay. there we go so the, the the eye colors look really pretty i'm just wondering if they're going to be really chalky or blendable or what have you for a dollar 25 is well worth the dip um, especially if you can get a little color payoff to try something new and different that you're not comfortable with and you don't want to make that deep dive to spend, you know, 20, 40, 50, 60, 130, 140 in a really nice eye palette. Um, this is a great way to go. So that's the winter. 
They have some really pretty colors in there. Then let's do autumn. So this is what the autumn looks like in the back. Really pretty. Nice bright orange. Again, really pretty. This one does have a mirror. Oh, these colors are so pretty. Wow. This one looks like it has like just a little bit of a boo-boo right there near the glitter. You'll see it though. I'm gonna do it like that. Can you guys see the colors good? Those are really pretty. I am loving the fact that a lot of them are like shimmers and we got, you know, one looks like one true glitter. The rest of them are shiver, shimmers and a couple of mattes right there. And and then it looks like you got some um, cheek colors right here too. So you got eye and cheek. Look how beautiful that is. That is really pretty. Kind of goes with my shirt, right? These colors, they're very complimentary to my shirt. And it has a nice big mirror. Very nice. I'm looking forward to seeing, you know, somebody do a little swatchy swatch or you know, whatever to see, you know, if they're chalky or not, like I said, I can't, I can't do it right now. Um, this one's spring, beautiful green color. <laughs> green is my favorite color. As you guys know, there's the back of the eye palette and let's pop this open, taking off the little thing. Oh, these are pretty. Ooh, these are gorgeous. Wow. Those are so pretty. Oh my gosh. Look at that green one. That is insane. Wow. I'm going to have a good time trying to play with these. Those colors on the top, like especially this one, will probably work really well as a contour for my face. That is beautiful. Wow, that spring one is, girl, that is hitting. And then the last one, it is called Summer, and it is in the red. You would think the summer would be in the white, you know, because summertime people wear white jeans, white shoes, white everything. Yeah, but that's what it looks like in the back. And let's take our peeky peek. All right. Oh, these are beautiful. Okay. These are beautiful too. Wow. Look how gorgeous they are. Wow. I'm looking at them right along with you. These have more shimmers than mattes. And you know me. I love a shimmer. I, I, I love shimmers. <laughs> These are beautiful. Look at that one. Wow. Okay. I'm looking forward to trying these. I am. Uh, like I said, it is well worth $1.25 just to be able to try out some new eye looks, play around with colors that you might be afraid to take a deep dive with financially. Um, to see if they work with a new look that you're trying to um, accomplish or in your hair color is a great way to do it. And also, I would think a really nice gift for young ladies that are trying to dip their toe in cosmetics and what have you. That's a great way to do it as well. And so I think that's everything for now. I might come back and do an evenings with Anna and open up the day one for the advent calendar for December the 1st. So I hope you come back for that and I'll see you there. Bye.